as the green light goes through. Power is on and we're ready to run race number six from the gardens. They're set. Racing now, bouncing away in front towards the inside. She's a marble. She's going to slip through and take over. Across from the outside, Zamboni misses. They travel down to the Judds. The circuit to go. Ruby Rad's got the second behind Zamboni miss. She's a marble back to third, but railing good. Uh, about two lengths away there to Katie Lots as they stride down the back straight. Uh, another four lengths away back in the field came. Uh, she's a slingslock. They were followed by Cooker Jagger. And uh, a long way back then to Millennia Jojo. Travelling towards the turn. Uh, and the leader bowling along in front, Ruby Rabs. She She's a marble, goes to the outsides after it quickly. She's a marble, Zamboni Miss runs home. Zamboni, uh, she's a marble, beats Zamboni Miss, Ruby Rabs. Uh, and then came Cooker Jack, she's a slingshot, Katie Lotts. Second last there was Frosty Sun. And the other one, Millennia Jojo. <coughs> Number one, she's a marble, just a little bit too strong at the finish. Number one, she's a marble, the winner. By Bella Infrared, Goodwin Future, owned and trained by Phil Wall. Number eight, Zimboni missed by Fizz. I've only pat the scorp in for Matthew Weir. And number three, Ruby Rab, Spring Gun, Ruby Jet for Dennis Solomon. A half a length, three quarters, and that run 35.66. And the winner on the total end, about $3. And it'll pay $3 for the win, $1.30, $1.90, and $2.90. Winning margin, a half a length, three quarters, and that run of 35.66. And uh, very close there for fourth. 9.59, and that run home time was 12.98. 1.83, close one for fourth.